Hello, good day everyone. So welcome back to my YouTube channel and today we'll be talking about addition and subtraction of fractions. This is college algebra. So how to add and subtract fraction? To add or subtract fractions having common denominator, add or subtract the numerators and place the result over the de common denominator. So let's try letter A. So in letter A, so I have here the expression 5 over 6x minus x minus 2 over 4x squared. So the thing that we're going to do is we're going to find the least common denominator of both expression, this expression and this expression. So the least common denominator of this one is 12x squared. So 12x squared is divided by 6x, that is equal to 2x times 5, so there are for 2x times 5. Minus 12x squared divided by 4x squared, that is equal to 3, so 3 times x minus 2. So we have 10x minus 3x minus plus 6 over 12x squared. So the result of this one is 7x plus 6 over 12x squared. So this is the result when you're going to simplify or reduce this one or you're going to add or subtract the fractions. Alright, so let's proceed with letter B. In letter B, we have here the expression, so 3a over a squared minus b squared plus b over a squared plus 2ab plus b squared minus 2 over a plus b. So first thing that we're going to do is we're going to factor here so that we could be able to get the LCD. So the factor of this one is a plus b and this is a minus b plus so we could express this one as b over a plus b quantity squared minus 2 over a plus b. Alright, so we have here, so take the uh, least common denominator. So we have the least common denominator is a plus b squared a minus b. So if we're going to have that a plus b squared and a minus b, so if we're going to take this one, the result divided here divided by here, the remaining is a plus b. So 3 times a plus b. Plus, when you divide here, the remaining is a minus b, so b times a minus b. And we have here minus 2, we have the result is 2 divided by here, the result of this part is a plus b and a minus b. Alright, so we have here 3a plus 3b plus ab minus b squared, you could simplify this one as a squared minus b squared based on our special product. So we have, have 2a squared plus 2b squared. We could have this one. Alright? So the result of this one is divided by a plus b squared a minus b. So we're going to combine here. So we have 3a, this is, uh, rather this is 3a, rather, so this is 3a squared. So 3a squared and 2a squared, the result of this one is a squared. Okay, a squared plus when we combine here, okay, we are going to combine a b so we have your 3 a squared 3 b plus b a b minus b squared minus uh, b squared minus 2 a squared plus 2 b squared all right all right so this is our other 3 a b so this is 3 a b because we have here okay so this will become 4 a, B, and when we subtract here, the result is plus B squared. 
over a plus b squared a minus b. So this is the result. Okay. So we have here for letter C. So the equation for letter C is x minus y over x plus y plus x plus y over x minus y. So we take the LCD of this one, x plus y, x minus y. So we have here, when we divide here, this x plus y minus x minus y divided by x plus y, their meaning is x minus y. So therefore, multiply this x minus y, x minus y squared. Plus, when you divide in this part, the result is x plus y squared. Okay, we're going to expand this one to x squared minus 2xy plus y squared based on our special product plus x squared plus 2xy plus y squared. Okay, over this is x squared minus y squared. Okay, so we have here 2x squared, cancel this part. And we have here plus 2y squared, or rather y, not minus plus, this is y squared, 2 right, 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 all right, so we have here 2y squared over x squared minus y squared. Let's go back here. So we have here x squared minus 2xy plus y squared plus x squared plus 2xy plus y squared. So therefore, x squared plus x squared, 2x squared, and y plus y squared, that's 2y squared. So, in this case, so that is the result. Okay. 2x squared plus 2y squared over x squared minus y squared. Next, we have number, we have number letter B, a letter D, okay. Our letter D, based on the example, let's recall letter D. Letter D, we have here letter D, 1 over x squared minus y squared minus 1 over x squared minus 2xy plus y squared. So first is we're going to factor this one, x minus y and x plus y. And this is x minus y and x minus y. So we have here the LCD of this part, we could have x minus y squared and x plus y. Divided by here, the resulting part is x minus y. Minus here, divided by here, the result is, when we divide this term, the result is x plus y. Their mean because this is x squared, x, y. So, if we're going to simplify, so we have 2x, no x, minus y minus x minus y over x minus y squared x plus y. So the remaining of this one is cancel minus 2y over x minus y squared and we have x plus y. So this is the answer for letter T. So try this at home, perform the indicated operation. So make sure to answer this one. Uh, okay, there's a trick with this one. So the same process last a while ago that when you could extract negative. Okay, so thank you so much for listening. I hope you learned something today. Thank you and God bless everyone.